hopefully y'all are well. I'll just do a quick mic check here, make sure everything's working. Looks all right on my end. <clears throat> Is everything uh, looking all right in your guys? give a uh, huge thank you and uh having some medical things going on right now so it's, it's not you know priority one but uh i just started messing with it trying it out a little bit and i'm really really enjoying it um the delimmer's working uh well well enough for the trees that we have we actually have some pretty pretty good sized trees so i might have to hop out and actually uh, uh do some limbing with the saw but uh, for the size of wood we have, uh, the limber's the limber's doing all right. Uh, something more along this size, it would do a lot better with. This is this is monster. So I'm playing around right now. Um, we don't have any really trash here. I thought about putting some dead wood in, uh, but I've also I've been working on this for two and a half hours, and we finally got a stream going. So, um, so I might make some pulp wood, softwood pulp, um, out of. I mean, yeah, it's all for it's all for fun. We're just gonna have some fun with it. But we got the logs here. I don't really know what considering uh, what the spacing would be on these. I don't know what people are really doing. I was going to get a uh, scorpion over here and kind of make the different lengths. That way I can have some, but the way I'm doing it right now, we've got eight foot here, uh, basically 10, 12, uh, 14, 16. So we'll be doing some 16 log or 12 logs, 16 logs. The rest will be pulled. That way I can uh, utilize the trailer. And we have a lot more time in this uh, 4370D. Um, MSM, I believe we've got from the uh, 540. Uh, we do have a grapple, and we also do have a buncher, but I've been doing some hand cutting with it. Um, let me see if I can't get... Stream Labs going here. I wasn't completely prepared. I wanted to uh, I wanted to have this all set up, but it it didn't happen that way. So I do apologize for not really being completely ready. But it wouldn't be a uh, rubber side down stream if I wasn't lacking in some sort of way here. So, Alright, so we've got this. We're going to take a look at that. And I just want to get the uh, comment section going. Just in case, that way I don't miss nobody. CNM Customs, what's up Bubba? Not sure, alright. So that looks good. Alright, so what I've got going on is we basically got the similar version of what we have at work. Um, the buncher, like I said, I'm not going to be using it yet. i got to get the controls down for that. Uh, we got the loader, and we don't have a grapple skitter at the moment because I don't have the controls ready for it. So, we'll go back and grab some 
do think there's a sound vehicle arm sensitivity camera sensitivity we want this up let me see if we got sound volume engines vehicle volume let's turn that down just a squash yeah one more you gotta save that Regular content, at least what's been regular, should be coming back. Uh, everybody knows I was hacked. Blah, blah, blah. But uh, my editing software was basically paid by month type of deal. So after that all happened, I lost my editing software. I lost everything as far as what I had for videos. And I was working on a free Windows editor. Then trying to learn another one temporarily until I can get the other one back. It just isn't happening, so uh, content will be coming back. But it's just uh, for the guys, the couple guys that do do enjoy the real life stuff. should be out soon. He's got a uh, very serious deal going on right now, so he's not able to put all of his time into it. So, it should be coming shortly. Um, the map itself, this is Elk Mountain, Wyoming. here all right so let me see oh I got the freaking let me see if we can't get that back off here B. there we go all right so we're gonna see what we can't do here so like I said I'm gonna be making some pulp logs and yes they're gonna be premium pulp but that's what we've got. That's all we've got for wood. And it looks like I lost one already. Must have hit it with a skitter. I don't know if I can sneak in there or not, but we'll try it. So this will be public. The uh, the John Deere is public already. Um, and if you really want a, John, uh, a, a loader with a slasher, the Barco by MSM is out there right now. Y'all can use that. It's actually that slasher. Uh, the only thing that that doesn't have is a delimiter on the front of it So this is like the total package where y'all can have both of them and have a total package But this is one unit kind of thing, you know, so Like I said, it's still in the uh, starting phase 
so just kind of give him give him a little bit of time he's working on it um, we'll do a 12 here and I'm not a loader man at work by any means I've done it uh, I do enjoy it but uh, you know it's not my normal normal deal that's why I wanted to work on it kind of work on it at home that way when I do go in I don't look like a complete noob when I'm using it this is free especially right now with diesel but the fact that we're working two, two hours away I really you know I don't go in on the weekends anymore but I do have the controls where I'm actually using my feet to turn <laughs> kind of cool um, but that is, so running the buncher right now is going to be about useless uh, running the skitter I've got to do with the uh, WASD so uh, like I said I'm, I'm trying to practice everything uh, as close as I can to work uh, controls that way I'm, I'm able to record for y'all a little bit but at the same time gain some practice for uh, for work so hopefully you guys kind of enjoy that uh, is the interior on 22 yet I don't was the interior back on uh, 19 did they actually convert that over to 19 I didn't play 19 much at all so I'm not sure if it even went to 19 but I'd have to talk to Sirius I haven't uh, I haven't actually talked to Sirius in quite a while but I haven't heard nothing about uh, the interior coming back so I'm not sure I know he's been trucking quite a bit lately so I wish there was a little bit more weight to these logs Maybe you could stack them a little easier I think right around here, what I want to do is get rid of them limbs right in my way here. Wait, I can see what the heck is going on. Alright, that one's got to go a little bit further. Um, We got Sean, what's going on, man? I uh, already got your question on the map. Yeah, I wish to, man. Uh, same with uh, War Bosby's map, which I forgot the name of already. But uh, I, w I was really enjoying that on 19. All right, let me see. We're putting this over in the bowl. She's small. Okay, let me try to get these just a little bit better off like I said the weight I thought the weight would be a little bit better in this game but it's still not uh, not so good they flop around quite a bit you accidentally bump them and there goes your stack uh, you got other guys that will be coming on and helping yeah absolutely I will um oop, hey there at the at the uh let me see if i can't um at the moment tom uh wanted me to keep it private so i didn't question i know a couple guys that do have the mod but he asked me to just keep it private so I didn't ask the guys that even have the mod to come on because I kind of wanted to I wanted to feel out the game in the uh, the way that I've always enjoyed playing it which is single player I mean I love multiplayer but the lag on multiplayer is pretty undesirable so not the uh, not the biggest fan of the 
the desync and whatnot. The game has enough of that, just just as the game is, you know. So. Them, grab this sucker. Open up. Depth perception still at a low. <laughs> we'll get it though. It'll come back to us. If I ever had it. I don't really remember to be honest with y'all. I did, like I said, I did actually buy a uh, VR headset. Uh, which I had full intention on actually trying to see if I could get it to work. Um, but we're not there yet. We're not there yet. We just, I haven't had no time. We're working, uh, we're working with mud season coming up, so hopefully, uh, we can stay working as long as we can, but after last week, man, it was, uh, it was rough. Not gonna lie. The skid trail we've got right now is pretty rough on the old body, so. Kind of nice to uh, kind of nice to have a weekend where I could just relax a little bit. I got uh, I got the old Ford F250 in the back going. Uh, she's not going great, but she is going nonetheless. Um, and then yesterday, I pretty sure we had a uh, had a pretty good little accident. <laughs> Won't go into huge detail, but I uh, was helping the uh, neighbor with a bit of a tree issue um, on some lines, and it didn't go well. But uh, everything went after we're all all everything said and done. Everything went uh, as good as as good as it could have for what happened, but uh, and nobody got hurt, luckily. Uh, and we were able to get everything fixed, so, yeah, it was one of them weekends. No calling nice egg. Let me know if you guys like these, uh, chill back streams without all of the, uh, other things going on. I know having other people to chat with. Oh, that wasn't a bad. That was a bad chuck. Other people to chat with definitely makes it easy. But uh, um, what's a good excavator out there for a game? To, to be honest with you, buddy, I I haven't really found one. Um, there's. There's a couple that are in, what, beta, alpha, whatever the heck you want to call it. I can't chuck tonight. Um, that have promise. I mean, uh, I really wish I could give you the name of it. It's like Bizbert or something like that. Um, that one I actually taught my son. A uh, six-year-old boy had to run a, a uh, cat controls on. He's actually pretty good on it. Uh, but as far as like quality and what you're probably looking for, that's that's about the best that I can really really tell you. Um, you know, I had the construction sim, and after probably six hours of messing with controls, finally got it where I wanted. Uh, and I think I might have played it for a half hour after that. After all the uh, the struggles of getting it working, it just really wasn't worth it. So. Um, 
from what the uh, guys are talking tonight, uh, we might be doing some uh, mining and stuff like that right here on uh, Farm Sim maybe next week. Um, the MSM guys that we were playing with last week, and um, they're on this map. And this has got that terraforming, from what I'm told, on here. And uh, they are mining at the moment. So I was I was kind of ready to uh, get into that, but after uh, TM Login had sent this over to me, I wanted to uh, I wanted to make sure that I I had made a little stream with it this weekend before everybody kind of got it. That way they could they could see what the thing is, you know, and what it's uh, what it's capable of. So we've got it. It's working great, actually. It's working fantastic. Uh, I wish I wish we could throw the uh, slasher the other way. That way we could work off the back of it. But you know that's kind of yeah, kind of just being whiny at the moment. It's it's working great. Uh, feels good. Grapple actually is very nice. It reminds me of uh, FDRs. I'm not sure if that's where this whole machine actually came from originally or whatnot, but the uh, the grapple seems like it picks well. Uh, trees are underweight again, but that's like, uh, what do you call it, like first impressions type of deal with 22, because last weekend when you got the, uh, you got that big stuff that we had, it's very easy, um, very easy to just make everything work um, or force it to work when you start getting into dangles come on get in there um, you know you can see how floaty it is where when you're working with multiple trees and a fixed head um, that's when you kind of get a little bit more weight to things it's kind of why I've always used a fixed head but now that I'm Actually, real life log, and we're using dangle equipment. I've guess changed to want to try it. see how this thing does when I start loading truck with it um, which hopefully we can get enough down tonight we can actually try some of that but we are really yeah, it was, well, it's a little bit longer piece but we'll run with it she still does have that shutter you guys can kind of see that piece of bolt out of that. I'm kind of asking a lot now, but yeah, I'm asking a lot. Alright, maybe a 16 out of this. this guy up first. We're not traditionally farm sim log in here. It's actually what I do for a living. I better be able to put something out there that people don't do, right? Or try to at least make it look decent while I'm doing it.
be pretty cool. Hopefully, uh, we can get the rookie logger in here too. Um, as most of you guys know, he he has the game. Um, we've been waiting for some uh, mods to come out. Exactly what we have right now is what I've been waiting for. That way, we can actually get a logging setup like we have um, and kind of capitalize on. Uh, actually looking like we know what we're doing <laughs> I guess but uh, turns out man that been in the skidder all week doesn't really want to go out and skid so no, I don't think we're going to reach that are we maybe we got her that's alright whatever so yeah, I want to be a loader man. Maybe we can get Ben bunching. And then if we can get a skitter man, we'll officially have one more guy than we do at work. <laughs> but uh, it'd be kind of cool to get a skitter guy in here. But as far as uh, what I'm going to have for people on a regular basis, I'm not quite sure yet. I do know that uh, AK was asking. But like I said, with uh, a mod that is not quite public yet I didn't want to bring anybody in here um, so as far as future projects with having people come in I do uh, I do definitely plan on it but uh, we will we will see how many we actually get. I know I had talked to Cam, you guys that had watched 17 for a while. Uh, Cam was interested in coming back, um, but I know he's big into Arma and stuff like that now, so I don't know if he'll still be interested or not, but um, we'll try to get some older boys in here. Uh, Rambo has actually been hanging around a little bit more. I've seen him in the chat. trying to think who else really really not too many people I don't I don't have uh, any contact with zombie dogs anymore uh, he was a good old boy um, really a lot of them guys have completely fell out of the farming sim kind of like I did uh, just haven't returned yet if they are going to so this is Kind of what I'm saying about too big a piece. It just wants to pull out of the jaws. Which I don't know if that's what one thing that he's kind of working on or not. But, yeah. So we're going to we're gonna pop this guy back out. And take another couple chunks out of him. Because he's just a little bit big. For the dilemma. That guy. Well, hopefully you guys are excited for this thing. I mean, uh, it'll be it'll be real nice for uh, people that don't have a lot of multiplayer time or other people to play with. Um, this is exactly exactly why I wanted this uh, because I don't exactly have people that are on the same time I am generally and I mean this is this is basically your processor it's your loader it's your uh, it's yeah I mean it, it delims it processes it loads trucks it stacks I mean so all you need to do is bring the wood to this thing and it does it all you know what I mean so that's that's why I was I was always wanting to use one of these, um, and even in 17, I do believe I do have some some content on this exact one. Um, but I, I don't know that it ever really took off because it's always it's always cooler to have the multi process. Um, you know, every, everybody has a different piece. You, the loader man you got the uh, 
you've got the uh, the processor, you've got you know all the all these different different functions. And when you have multiple people, it's perfect for it. But if you're missing one guy and he's got to jump out and do the other task, it it just uh, why not run something like this? You know, I don't I don't see many people actually. I don't see anybody running this thing except for. Uh, TM login and I have to I have to go back I'll, I'll try to throw a link to his uh, uh, yeah, I know he's got a twitch page I'm not sure if he's YouTube or not but uh, I really haven't talked to him too much he actually popped in tonight but uh, he was talking to the other guys we really haven't chatted much so um, but if he's feeling up to it some night hopefully uh, I can get him actually in and maybe we could do some play and I know I I love watching him uh, use this thing it was pretty pretty cool he's got years of uh, I think he said something like 19 years driving and if I'm not mistaken quite a few years of actually utilizing the loader with a uh, slasher so you, you can you can see a experienced operator at work when you watch him, you know, everything's just done in such a way that it's, it's beautiful. You know, it's just like watching uh, Ward Bosby running the uh, the Buffaloes and whatnot. I mean, maybe he doesn't do in real life, but from everything that I've kind of gained, he's in the woods in some sort of fashion. So, I mean, you can see the the little tricks that they have. And even just watching Ben, you know, um, I'm starting to get that with uh, like skid and like taking a hitch. If you've got a really rough spot, taking a hitch out, putting it into uh, into the bad spot, basically driving over the top of it in order to get logs out. I mean, with hardwood, we do it a lot. Softwood, not so much, but um, there's a lot of a lot of little tricks that you kind of gain by doing it in real life and the fact that you can kind of manipulate that in the uh the farming sim is it's pretty cool it's not all really for show it's more or less different ways of utilizing utilizing these little things We'll get the flick. We'll get it. Oh, come on. Make a 16 out of you. And I don't know that this is actually 16 in the game by any means, guys. I just know how our rack set up. Um, so that's kind of where I'm going with it here. Generally, we'd take go over it a little bit but of course we're looking down on it too this is it's exactly the opposite way on this Sixteen. Is going to be enough? Oh. Depth perception added again. to move these uh, what was the map you were talking about doing the mining on uh, the map that I'm on right now uh, has the mining on it uh, at least I don't know if it's the mining or if it's terraform uh, but I do know that I have the mod 
and that the uh, the guys are actually using it. And this map right here is called Elk Mountain, Wyoming. How you doing, Marcus? I believe it's the same map we were on last weekend. We were working in the woods last weekend on this map to uh, start the terraform the gold mining and stuff like that, but uh, we didn't get there as far as money wise. Let's see if we can. Oops. But we didn't just. Yeah, we did. Shoot. problem buddy anytime y'all have a question just throw it up there I'll get to it I gotta get back into the uh, the streaming life usually I'm doing something else something going on that's the way it goes these controls seem so sluggish tonight. But yeah, I'm really liking the map. Uh, I went we did a little drive through last week uh, trying to find the mill tonight I don't know if we're gonna actually go for a mill trip or not uh, I do have a pretty sweet looking truck I think it's a lizard to be honest with you but I did see it on the uh, the mod hub and I, I downloaded it and I was quite impressed with the amount of amount of things you can actually do with the thing I can actually show you right now I can bring you all over that real quick um, but it kind of remember uh, reminds me of uh, is it Diesel Dave or not Diesel Dave um, Diesel Brothers got a beautiful uh, Kenworth all blacked out and whatnot. I'll show you guys that real quick. Like I said, I believe it's a lizard. But I mean, it's got like a Peterbilt hood on it. Peterbilt looking hood, but it looks pretty heavy, you know. I don't know. I like it. For what it is, it's a Phoenix. That's what it is. It's a Phoenix. I'll show you guys in the shop real quick. Uh, there's three different versions. Um, where are you? Right here. Lizard Motors. There's a TLX Phoenix. Uh, CMS. The, uh, so I don't know. I know when I built this one originally I can show you that like I wasn't able to find um, like dual exhaust like this one's got mud guards oh well never mind okay <laughs> I was gonna say but when I built the cat I was able to find dual so I don't know what the difference is if it's maybe engines whatever uh county cross hybrid max torque this has got a uh mac transmission in it um i don't know that's what we ran in our uh mac truck so that dot sounds 485 
45. So I, I don't really know what the difference is. Either way. Or if there is a difference. And it might it might stick right out to y'all. But uh, either way. Uh, that's what they are. A little bit of resemblance there. But. Um, and everything else we've got. I do have the. Uh, I went with a pulp style trailer that we run uh, for the pulp because I wanted to like I said the more time in the loader tonight the better off I'm gonna be uh, just because I am working look at this pile it did not look like that from the cab did it well maybe it did a little bit <laughs> no, we can stack we can play with it I just wanted to get some seat time in it to be honest with y'all um, see how this thing picks Still got that weird, weird gap between the logs, which isn't a 19 or a 22 thing. That's that's been going on for quite a few years now. But uh, yeah, like I said, I'm really, really enjoying this. I hope, hope you guys are. Um, this definitely uh, it's going to help me out at work. And being able to try to live stream on Sundays um, should be pretty easy for me. I usually do the church in the morning and then uh, a little bit of family time, go out to lunch. And then come in and veg out with this for a little bit. And then we do some games with the kids after I get done the stream. I think that's what we're going to start doing. And then uh, back to work Monday, so. be kind of nice to have a little schedule for Sundays. I don't know if we'll end up doing uh, things throughout the week or not yet, but uh, besides the normal vlogging videos. But hopefully we can, uh, can do something. And kind of keep uh, keep the majority of y'all happy with the uh, having the farm sim back on the channel because it doesn't it doesn't hurt at all to uh, sit down and actually relax. Usually I'm so freaking high strung. Anytime that I'm at home, I'm trying to trying to do something, but on Sundays I usually end up messing up more than I fix. So I think we're just gonna leave Sunday alone. making no money. We're definitely burning a lot of fuel, though. I just cannot hit that square. There we go. Come on, stop itching. I think... Stack that there for the skidder man. Think straighter here. Oh, well, that's not the way we wanted to do it. Bingo. Need to find a way to glue this thing down to the ground. I don't 
don't know that more weight's going to fix it either because then you just can't pull it around. She's slippery. Well, this is not turning out very well, is it? Huh. Get it out of there. Skitter man's problem. Right, Ben? <laughs> Sixteen out of you. Do a nice lengthy auto save. All right, a little bit more. I want to put these somewhere different. I don't like them stacked like that. I was hoping that I could actually get them like, uh, to stop the pulp from moving, but it doesn't seem like it really matters the length of the wood. Uh, it seems like they all just want to move anyway, so... I think what I'll do is I'll just freaking put the 16s. See what I'm saying? I'm bumping the 12s, and they're, they're even moving, so... I don't think it really matters. I wonder if 15, I'd like to get back on 15 and try to remember how them felt because that was, that was a, I don't know. It might have been just as bad, if not worse, but with it being so fresh and new at that time, it felt good, you know? So, I'd like to know what y'all think um, from playing. Everybody out there that watches me, I'm pretty sure. Really? Uh, viewers will expect to experience buffering. Uh, let me know if she's running rough for you guys. I just got an alert, so. Sometimes it does that. It definitely keep me in the loop. If I need to uh, try to fix the OBS, I definitely will. Yeah, my end-to-end -end placement's not looking the best, that's for sure. But, that's what we've got. Um, when are you going farming? Boy, oh boy. I forgot how this is. The live stream. Doesn't matter what you do. <laughs> When am I going farming? Well, when they actually come out with something that reminds me of farming, I will farm. But until then, my boy, I don't, I uh, don't really think. To be honest with you, I'm really waiting for the, uh, for the terrain mod that we had in 19 uh, to come back, where you actually drove over the, the land, and the terrain started to get muddy. I mean that was that was awesome. I didn't realize that came out till late 19. Where I was like taking a plow and making freaking skid roads with a plow. 
and then all you had to do was just drive and all of a sudden the, the ground would actually react to you driving over that was that was pretty cool but yeah farming uh maybe i don't know people that usually want to watch the log and don't want to watch the farming so and there's so many farmers out there good farmers that you know logging has kind of been one of them things where now there are good loggers out there on the uh on farm sim that people really you know they don't take to my channel anymore because there's so many to choose from and there's guys that are actually you know good at this stuff like editing and doing it all day or every couple days type of deal where I you know I've, I've got obligations and other things to do so now I don't know if we'll, we'll get into the farm and maybe but uh, don't hold your breath on it, man. We'll see what happens. Like I said, I don't, uh, I don't play games much. I really never did. I mean, I would take the old live streams that I made on the weekends or whatever day it was, and I'd make a couple videos out of that one live stream, and that was kind of how I did YouTube back in the day. So, you know, I just kind of uh, tried to make hay when I was making videos or making content on it, and that's kind of the way the channel had always been. Um, but I am not really what you'd call a gamer, I'd say. I'm more of a work addict. I just, uh, I do this when it's either crappy out or it's, uh, Sundays now. I mean, that's my day of rest, so. But we'll, we'll see. I, uh, I have actually seen some pretty nice looking uh, John Deere tractors that I wouldn't mind taking a look at. And because I do like technical things like loader work and bailing and uh, doing, um, you know, um, silage. That, that's primarily what I do when I'm, I'm farming anyway. Just because there's loader work and, you know, packing bunks and doing that type of stuff it's just different you know the cows i love i love doing the cow cow jobs on the game so there is definitely uh potential for it it's just uh like i said i mean people gripe when i'm making real life content on logging they want me to freaking be in a pixel logging type of deal and then when i'm logging people want me to go and do farming work it, it's almost enough to make you insane so Either way. One of them deals. Let me see if I can't. Just for giggles here. Boom. I don't know why I couldn't, but it is farm sim, so let me see. We had a butt board. Hey, it does work. Now we get to go play with a noisy skitter. Like I said, I did some hand cutting back here, so don't uh, don't get too crazy in the comments. It's not beautiful, but it's what we got. Log stacks looking. Oh yeah. quality that's great all right wait and see looks good additional stream health is rough maybe two is not receiving enough Stream health is excellent. Okay, so I don't know. It's not saying. But 
we're gonna rock on with it.
those sticky keys. Darn it. These are some big, big girls. I've actually had to help Ben quite a few times with the skitter on trees like this, but grab them with a the skitter and grab them with a the loader. So the loader just will not pick them up, but I don't think we'll have that issue at all with farming soon. Swing her right in here. Wish we had a uh, thumb or a thumb. A retractable guy on this heel. Alright, that actually looks somewhat square, so we're gonna rock that. No, no, that doesn't look square at all, actually. Alright, so, boom. Okay. I don't know if that's going to cause an issue or not, but we're going to see. Alright, 16, here we come. Sixteen eight. Two inches of too much. I think what we're going to end up doing is doing a little bit of hand lemon because these are just a bit fuzzy. Down to where she's manageable. back over, get her swinging around, that's a bit on the Conservative side there. Oh, don't do that. Son of a gun. I think we're getting worse as the day goes on. Oh, for sure. Alright, that's better. Let me see if I can't double that. I don't know. No, 
we're not going to do that because that's going to make you shorter because you have a bit of a wiggle worm going on. There we go. down a little bit so we'll make this a 16 or a 12 well, I'm gonna call 12 that looks all right sure and how are we looking on the butt here we're looking small enough to try to do some women Kind of hoping this thing would get uh, a little bit of wear going to it, but it don't seem like it. We've already got 1.7 hours going. It does not take these things long to uh, show their age. because I'm feeling good. Auto save. Thank you. Why? Why didn't you cut? There it is. Perfect. I'd say that server desync, but we're not on the server. All right. So three is too many. Noted. girls. Okay there. Whoa. Whoa. She's getting crazy. Oh, there she be. Good job. Well, production is definitely not top priority with this type of uh, vlogging. <laughs> but I am having a good time. I hope I hope some of y'all that uh, check this out on the VOD later enjoy it. 
like I said, it's uh, this is this is the way to play farm sim for me. It's not production. It's not making money. You know, all you got to do is put government subsidies on. You can make as much money as you want, or make yourself a solar farm, and somehow that does a lot. So, this is what I do to enjoy farm sim. Uh, so if you guys enjoyed that, make sure you guys give her a thumbs up. And don't be afraid to leave some comments. I definitely enjoy... Uh, whoa, there he goes. And now for my next trick. I definitely enjoy reading the comments. Um, regardless of what, what the uh, comment's about. The login side, I don't hardly get anything. But when the uh, simulating stuff happens... Oh watch out so I wonder how many of these it would take to load a truck we're gonna find out probably in the next video I'm actually enjoying this so much that I might actually uh seeing how this week is going to be kind of poopy out um, like right now we had 70 we hit 70 degrees yesterday lost all of our snow and it was a gorgeous day um, but I just got an alert that we got snow coming so um, probably won't be out enjoying as much as I did this past week but uh, with how this is actually feeling I might I might get on and do a little bit of uh, streaming on this this upcoming week maybe not we'll see what goes on but this feels satisfying in a weird way not only am I actually <laughs> making myself a little bit more con um, what do you call it? A little bit better on the work controls, but I'm actually uh, feeling like I'm actually getting a feel for the game again. Of course, that's when stupid stuff starts to happen, right? But it's a game. Kevin, what's going on, little buddy? Have you been fishing? Uh oh. Drop in there. Darn right. Uh, logging. You've been logging. You liar. You straight lying to me. Oh, hey there. Whoa. Slow down. Float. Slow down. There we go. Clamp. Easy, Bessie. Easy. Open her up. Close it. Grab it. Hook it. Loop it. Go. You've been logging. What are you doing? You using the uh, the British logging stuff or? Pulp again. Boom. What'd you do? You get some American stuff in there? Canadian? Hey there, stop. Uh, level 70, almost level 71. What are you talking about? Are you talking about escape from Tarkov or fishing? What? Logging? Yep. Oh, must be fishing. Must be fishing. I don't know. I played that for a little while. Like I said, I. It's alright. Oh, 
Oh, that was too short, but that's okay. The mill won't know. They cut him in half anyway. The driver might have a bit of an issue, but uh tried for a bit and got into fishing planet, did ya? I wish I could say I'm actually making something happen here, but my stack of pulp is kind of lacking. Uh-oh. There should be. We're getting there, though. We're getting there. Could really use a uh, skitter guy next week, and no. Maybe I'll uh, I'll get with uh, Tom and see see what he what he thinks about like uh, what he's looking at for time and whatnot because this is the only mod that I have that's not exactly public yet so it's supposed to be going public soon and there are parts of every part to this mod is public but the uh, the loader with the slasher is not so the loader with the dilemmer. And then the, uh, like I said, the, the Barco with the Slasher is public, but the John Deere with the Delimmer and Slasher is not public. So if he checks out the video, which I'm going to be putting over onto his uh, Discord after I get done with this, and then maybe make some video clips from it, um, maybe I can get you in here next weekend or something like that. Are you going to cut? It did cut. It just cut so... Just nice. Things don't move. That'll work. You're out of the way. Alright. We're doing 16. Kids are going crazy downstairs. If you guys hear that, so apologize. <laughs> bedtime for sure um y'all be able to hear that or not. They were getting a little bit hypey. Hypey grayed out. So. Uh, and then the dog started going crazy, so I didn't, I had to mute for a minute. Um, what else is going on? I don't know. I think we'll do these, uh, what have we got? Two left. I think we'll get these three done. We'll end her there. I do appreciate you guys coming in, though. This has been uh, enjoyable for me. Hopefully you guys have gotten a little bit out of it. Old rubber side down is getting the controls back. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get back into uh, something going on. I'm I'm looking forward to it. The uh, the game's feeling all right. Like I said, the logs are a little bit, little bit light, but um, I'd log, log with you for sure. We should talk later for sure. <laughs> Alright, Bubba. Sounds good, for sure. We do a... Come on. Get out of there. Um, try to do a piece of pulp out of this, just because it's got a lot of... scarring right there. Yeah, for sure. That's that's horrible. Look at that. Red rot. Um, need some variation in the wood, eh? 
That would be kind of nice. Get a little bit of hardwood. I know it's a pain in the butt. I mean, I don't really know what this would even be considered. If this would be, uh, maybe it is hardwood and it's uh, uh, like Douglas fir be considered. Maybe. Maybe. It, I mean, to me, it looks like spruce, but it's huge. What's up, Kobe? How you doing, Bubba? I'm doing good. Doing a little FS log in here. Trying out a uh, new toy that y'all be seeing and hopefully getting here shortly. Doing a little somewhat, not nearly as good as Tom's demonstration of this thing. But it is my first time using it, so bear with me, bear with me. Oh, hey there. Whoa, hey there. All right, close. I got to ch change that control up. It's just a, not right. Open. Grab down. Right, open. So how's Colby doing? First time you're coming in for one of my streams, or I don't, I don't think I've recognized your name. Quite honestly, with you. Oh, hey there, get on this side of that. A little bit long in the tooth there, but that's okay. Rock on. Did it again. Oh no. Okay. Oh, she's getting crazy. She's getting crazy on me. What are we gonna do here, low? What do I have to do last time? I had to grab a big tree, didn't I? Uh, let me see. She's giving troubles now. All right, here we go. Scoop that up. Still giving me problems. Come on. Get out of there. Get out of there. Yeah, she's twisting on me. Leave you alone for a minute. See if you fall out. got a danger zone right there for some reason. I don't know what causes that, but there's a collision and it seems like once it pushes through it's good to good to just stay there apparently. It don't bother it no more. Oh there it is. Oh she was almost there. Alright we'll grab a quick quick sixteen out of you. Oh or not falling. She's a coming. Uh, get in there. Boom. Boy, I wish that thing would figure it off. There she be. Good. Okay. Grab this guy. No, we'll get you out of there, though. I do not want you in there. Stop it. Right. 
16s are filling up a lot faster. No, they're a lot bigger too. All right, let's try to grab that piece of pulp real quick. Ooh, hey there, hey there, stop. it again. Pretty sure we're actually moving now. Starting to push away from the pole pile. Uh, one more 16, one more 12, and then pole. I don't think that cut anything, did it? Nope. There should be. Nope. What are you on? There we go. She's getting crazy. Might be because I have this tree on top of another tree, which I haven't really been doing. But I wanted to kind of test that just because when you're logging, this is extremely clean. And we're keeping this place really tidy for what we're actually doing here. So, all right, we'll do a 12. There was a way to glue this thing down a little bit. Did I leave myself enough room there? Don't look like it, does it? Nope. Open. Drop it. I do know this thing does have a, uh, a saw. So if I wanted to do like log link, I actually could just use the uh, delimmer and then use the saw that's actually built on the back side of that delimmer. But because I am trying to make it like what we actually have at work, I'm not using that saw. So just to let you guys know, there is actually a saw in the back of that delimmer. So if you were doing telephone poles or whatever, you actually wouldn't need to use the slasher at all. would be very handy at work but and I actually was going to use it here um, to kind of get the uh, the limbs and everything behind the the delimmer that you don't actually get with this game because they just disappear but uh, it's my first night with it so we'll, we'll see how see how people take it if it's too boring for people that's that's gonna be what it is, but this is this is what logging is to me now. You know, I mean, uh, East Coast logging is a lot different than West Coast. Not saying we don't have a lot of that stuff, um, but we don't have a lot of that stuff around here. I guess there was a outfit. Uh, I'm not quite sure about the name right now, off the top of my head. But Ben was telling me that one of the uh, outfits we have actually did get a, uh, I don't remember if it was a buffalo scorpion combo or what they were using, maybe John Deere even, um, of like the uh, standard, I don't know if it would be European way of logging or whatever, but uh, supposedly, oh, I think it was John, um, and it just, uh, the diameter of trees that we have is just too big for that type of equipment. 
I thought that was kind of interesting because I actually uh, I applied for a job before I uh, went full time logging um, for lime lumber, and they used the uh, the rotney or rot rotine or whatever the heck the blue blue uh, equipment is in this game here. Uh, they actually use that equipment. So uh, it was kind of cool. I was I was pretty close to uh, going after and taking a look at how that type of uh, process works. But they ended up hiring somebody the same day I put my application in. So didn't end up working out. But I thought that was kind of cool. All right, I think. What I might do, I don't know if I can actually move this thing forward. Maybe I have to pick the legs up. G. Right. No, I can't. Okay. So I would like to put myself back where I was. A couple, a couple too many. Uh, Smacks of that grapple on the ground has moved it. Like I said, I wish it was great. Process this guy up, and then we'll see. I don't want to go too too far with it, but we will see what exactly happens overnight when I leave this thing with the tops, with the stumps, with the pigs around. And I want to see exactly how this thing reacts because generally the trees would go all spastic when you log back in. At least in 19 and 17, we had that happen quite a few times. So I'm kind of interested to see if we leave it kind of messy. And if I was to leave this tree right here on top of that pig that's down there, generally this tree would go flying when you log back in. That's what we used to have happen quite a bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a mess. And I really wanted to leave a mess just in general to kind of see how much realism you can actually have. Because logging is not, unless you're doing full freaking chipping and whatnot, but even then, it's pretty messy. And the way the game makes you do it, really, a lot of these environmentalists and all that don't have a leg to stand on. If this was, if this was really how it was, you know. So, um, but it's just, it's, you know, you you got limbs, you got stumps, you got tops you got all this other stuff that just it's got to go somewhere usually you recycle it back into the trail and you kind of break it down as you drive over the stuff but in this game it is so clean you know it's almost like the uh, the maintenance side of it I've never had a hydraulic line break in farming sim and we've had quite a few in the woods so that'd be kind of cool DLC get greasy Kind of like the, uh, hey guys, we're going logging for today. As soon as you get in, you blow a hydraulic line. Six hours later, you finally get that line fixed to realize that, you know, a clamp is chafing other lines. So you basically waste a whole stream on fixing the equipment. And you want to talk about realism? I mean, take my money now. So, <laughs> that'd be cool. But... 
It is kind of nice to just have things work. guy back through. Oh, hey there. Whoa. Is that going to fly? I don't know. Oh, I'm pretty sure there goes my pile. Yeah, that's cool. All right, let's try to get you off of there. Oh, boy. How much did we ruin? Nothing yet. Okay. Try that one more time. No, not like that though. It's not the mod's fault. It is my fault. Pretty sure I'm not being farming some gentle with this tree. It, well, I guess it would too. I was going to say, I really like how it delims everything in one swipe. But when you're working with softwood, it's really not all that bad in real life either. That's great. Come on. We're making a video. Come on. Boom. There we go. Close up. Grab on. Over. And in one swipe, you're supposed to be able to grab back a little bit on the tree, but that's all right. We'll get it. It's going nuts. back here. I don't know what happened to it, but fix that real quick. There we go. Alright. Where are we going? We're going pulp. Going crazy again, guys. Apologize.
Alright, there we go, guys. Like I said, a little bit uh, more and more I do with this, I'll get better. Um, hopefully it'll be a joy to watch like back in the day when you guys enjoyed the uh, the buffalo stuff I'd like to get I'd like to get proficient with the game again uh, and that's just gonna take time you know this isn't uh, it isn't real life there's definitely a lot less feedback and a lot more jankiness with this stuff so um, but again real life stuff is pretty jank too so either way I'm gonna end it there try to chuck this pig and uh nope <laughs> but uh hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, hopefully it's been a great weekend for y'all i know we've enjoyed it here um nope just the gravity's just just off i can even chuck in a skitter i can't chuck in this freaking thing though Um, yeah, either way, guys, God bless y'all. We will see you next time. And thank you again, uh, TM Logan. This has been an absolute blast to play with.